on and now. Oh, that's good. Mmm. Blue raspberry lemonade. Well, Jaden, baby son, say lemonade. Lemonade. <laughs> it, that strip like a cross right there. Ooh, I can feel it now. I just want to play with the wine. You can call me with me. I know that he'll mind me. This is the baddest for school. Today kicks off a new weekly vlog. If you're new here, my name is Poe. To comment, like, share, and subscribe. Just got off of work. Of course, I stopped by HEB. I'm warming up some leftovers now. That's my cabbage and some more meatballs back there. Just the rice and a little bit of meatballs. Um, yeah, this is the leftovers that I cooked Sunday. So I gotta finish this off today. It's Tuesday. Hey y'all, excuse my hair. Took my braids, uh, my braid down on Sunday, washed it in. This is how it's been. I've been to the gym. I went yesterday and I went this morning. So yeah, we're going all week. So I'm just going to probably wait till Friday to try to do something to my hair. Probably flat iron or whatever. We're going to wait till Friday. But, um, doing nothing much today. Went to work. About to get Eli in a little bit. Let me show you all. I'm going to make me some faux Saturday. I've been craving foe. Craving foe. Like, I've been seeing it all on my timeline. It's actually this place on, like, Beach Nut and Gaston, I think, called Foe something. I used to go to all the time. So good. It's expensive because I think, like, a bowl of foe is, like, maybe, like, $30. But you can get shrimp, beef, or whatever, or you can mix it, the combination. But I found these at H-E-B. Beef foe, they got chicken too. So it comes with like the noodles in there. I think this, uh, like the sauce. Like the noodles and the sauce, is, it come in here. It says it, um, dried rice noodles, foveen, cubes, spices, spices, chopsticks, sriracha package. I won't be using it. Oh, it comes with like everything that you need for foe. Horses, I never know how to say that, but I use it in my, uh, <laughs> shrimp fried rice. Hostess and sauce, whatever that, and then it has a dry green onion and cilantro mix. So everything is in here because I end up at HEB getting um a beef broth. I know I gotta get the meat. I gotta get the uh, like the skirt steaks and simmer it, saute it, and then uh, I wanna add shrimp too because I want beef and shrimp. But everything besides the meat is up in here, so I won't even need that beef broth. I'll just cook it all in a pot because I got two of them because I want a big old bowl. I'm telling you, I've been craving it. I'm going to make this Saturday. I got two. But yeah, y'all. ain't doing nothing much. Um, I think today is Tuesday, so y'all saw on Sunday me and Aaron made Kool-Aid pickles. So I think we're going to try pickles in a minute or maybe later on because they've been sitting since Sunday, so it's two days. So yeah. That's it. I ain't doing much. I might pick y'all back up tomorrow or later on when me and Aaron try the pickles. Happy Tuesday, y'all. Oh, yeah, y'all. Nothing but cake. Y'all already know. Nothing but cake has a, a new turtle cake. And then I saw on their door, my sister went and got the turtle cake. She wanted to send it to me. I saw on their door that they got um the Oreo cake is back, too. I'm going to get both of them. The Oreo, did y'all try the Oreo cake when it was here last year? That was the first time it came, so it's back. I think it came out in April last year, but now it's it's out in March. But they had a new turtle cake. Caramel, pecans, chocolate. Y'all know we're going to go try it. So we probably try that tomorrow evening. Of course, take y'all with me. We're going to try it. Rate it. 1 through 10. Talk to y'all later. Happy Tuesday. Hey, y'all. Good morning. Happy Wednesday. I just left the gym. Got a nice little workout in. I did um, 30 minutes on the treadmill, incline 15. Well, I gradually built up. Every 10 minutes, I went up. So I started like at 10, then I went to like 12, and then 15, 30 minutes. I burned like 350 calories. Mind you, I've been fasting before I go to the gym, so I haven't eaten anything. But I did have a C4. Um, 
And then I did, I've been doing like leg press because I'm trying to get my legs together. Like, I want my legs to be not like muscle, but a little bit more toned. I got cellulite, so I know it ain't going to completely go away because it's hard to lose cellulite. Even I've seen people with nice legs that still have like cellulite. I just want to tone them a little bit more, but you can still look good though. But no gym in two months. It's day three. I've been back three days. So I think tomorrow I'm going to do my apartment's gym. And then Friday I'm going to uh, do Fitness Connection. Because I want to sit in the sauna. So I'm going to go like really early on Friday and sit in the sauna too. So yeah, I'm about to take me a bath, head to work. I'm going to stop by... Uh, Poppy has a new soda. Y'all know I love Poppy. They have a, I think it's Blue Raspberry Fizz or something like that. Y'all know I gotta try it. And they come in, so they partner with Circle K. Their cans are bigger at Circle K. So a regular can of Poppy is like two forty six, so they can probably three fifty four dollars But I want to try the Blue, Blue Raspberry one. And I think it's one eight minutes away from my house because I looked on maps. So I'm gonna go see if we can find it so I can try it. Probably drinking for lunch or something. Then I'm going to uh, Nothing But Cake. They have a new turtle cake and the Oreo cake is back. So I'm going to go get the turtle cake and the Oreo cake. Because I got to try that turtle cake. Oh, I bet that turtle cake good. I'm going to get that. And me and Aaron was supposed to try our um, try the pickles. So this is day three because we made them on Sunday. So they should be extra good today. We're going to try them today. Cause she was asleep last night when we were supposed to try them. But yeah, I'm going to take a shower and head to work. I'm gonna pick you guys back up later. Happy Wednesday, y'all. Oh, and I need to finish editing this video so it can come out tomorrow. So I'm, I'll be back on my schedule. If I finish it today or tonight, I'll schedule it for tomorrow, Thursdays and Sundays. So we'll be back on schedule. And I see all y'all. I miss y'all too. We're back. Hey, y'all. Just got home. It's hot as hell outside. When I say hot, it's hot. It's 81 outside. It's hot. It's going to be a hot summer. Hopefully, it be this hot for spring break when we take the kids to San Antonio. We got an Airbnb pool. Because it seems like the week of spring break, it be cool. The last year we went to Margaritaville, it was cool and windy. And then, no, the year before last year we went to Margaritaville, last year we went to that cabin and it was cool. We did the indoor, um, we did the indoor water park but still outside it was cool so hopefully stay hot like this but i did go to nothing bun cake as y'all seen i had to it on my phone and take my camera in but i went to nothing bun cake i got the oreo and i got the turtle i'm so excited about this one chocolate turtle like it got pecans in there but i'm about to eat um this little sub sandwich that i got from h-e-b and some chips i drink a poppy and um we're gonna try that later See if Ann wanna try it with me when she get home. It's early. It's 2 27. Oh, and my stuff from Amazon came. I ordered. I don't know if the lighting is good. Let's see. I ordered us some shower curtains. I basically got about everything. I do wanna put some pictures on this wall. So I'm looking for some pictures or maybe a mirror and then two small pictures on the side. I don't know. I'm going to ask Ashley because she's the decor queen. She decorated her whole house really nice. So I ordered this. Y'all can't really see. This is a shower curtain I ordered from my bathroom. It's like gold, silver. Because I already have gray in my, um, my rugs are already gray in the bathroom. So I ordered this. like marble can y'all see it's like white gold silver I don't know we'll see once I hang it up I don't know about this and it kind of feels thin and cheap but I got a liner we'll see and I ordered one for Aaron in the bathroom they rugs and they're already like a blue Navy blue, white, and gray. And I put 
some gray towels up in there. They all came with these little plastic silver cheap ass hooks. I ain't using these hooks. I got my own hooks. This is the one for their bathroom. This one look okay. set of these hooks so somebody will have to get the cheap ones for now and it's gonna be me I ain't gonna get them these ones so I'm gonna get them these let's hang it up and see and I put these towels up these were in my bathroom at the house and I put this picture right in here too in their bathroom that was at the old house too and these were in my bathroom at the old house why is the line along in the actual shower okay why anyways that's the shower curtain y'all and that's one of the rugs so it matched perfect that rug is like gray bluish white and that rug is blue it needs to be dusted off but yeah it works for now because Erin wanted a shower curtain. She hasn't had a shower curtain since then. She likes to take showers. So she'll be excited. It's going to work for now. If I find like a better one, because it's kind of, I don't know, I thought it was it's not that good of a good quality, but it was $16.99. So yeah, what you paid for it? If I find like a better, cuter one that still match the colors in here at Home's Good, Marshall's, or whatever, I'll get it. It works for now. One for my bathroom, I don't know. I definitely don't know about that one. That one definitely might go back. I'm about to go try to hang it up and see though. We're in my bathroom. I'm just gonna put one right here. These hooks definitely ain't gonna work. They so damn cheap in dollar stores. But let me just hang one right here and then one on the end. I ain't even put the line on yet because this this definitely might go back. This one just might give me what I thought it was gonna give. And my rugs are gray. So that's why. I, and then I got some like gold little things on the counter. Get these. And this one on the other side where my perfume is. So I was going to do gold and gray in here. This is like a. Hmm. It might work for now, shit. I don't know. I know Amazon's tired of me sending shit back. <laughs> I've been sending stuff back like I've been ordering for the house. I've been sending stuff back. So I might just keep this and I might just get some um some gold clippy things from Amazon. I might order some gold clippy things and just keep it for now. Whatever. Y'all can't really see because... It's like a marble and my rugs are gray. Yeah, I also ordered this. It's clear. Can y'all see it? It's a little wreath hanger. Y'all know the uh Easter reef I showed y'all with the eggs. It's on the door, but I got it hanging on some thing on the door. I ordered this so I don't have to take it off and I can just be one of those reef girls like for every season. Hang my reefs and I don't have to pin it to the door and then like that. So I'm about to change it up. Put it on the door when I open it up. I'm about to eat my lunch. I got this sub. I tried it last week. It's so good. It's from H-E-B, like water sandwiches. It's called Antonio's. This is the uh, turkey and Swiss. It's roasted turkey, Swiss cheese, mayo, and sweet pickles. Bum. And I got some chips. Y'all, y'all know I don't like spicy food and nothing spicy. I've been on, like, hot chips. And... I had some hot funyuns the other day, and I've been eating hot chips. I don't know what's going on. Y'all know I don't like nothing spicy, but I've been eating hot chips. I got to pop you, of course. And I meant to tell y'all, I went to Circle K 
before I went to work and they did not have that wild berry uh, poppy, the blue one, they didn't have it. They didn't even know what poppy was. Cause I looked at first and then I asked the girl at the register and I think the manager was behind her cause she asked her and she was like, never heard of it. I was like, yeah, some probiotic soda. They never heard of it, so they didn't have it. And then I looked online, I didn't see, only place that has it is Amazon. And you gotta buy a case for $35, for 12. $35 for 12 I was like, yeah, nah. I'll wait till it comes to the store. Just like the cranberry fizz, I never found it in the store. That was on Amazon, too, for a crazy amount of price. Like, why don't y'all just put it in the store? Y'all want people to buy it off Amazon. And Poppy on Instagram advertises it and tell you to go to Amazon and get it in Cycle K. But no Cycle K that I look has it. Oh, well, I'm not paying $35 on Amazon, though. That's not happening. But I'm about to eat this, and then we're going to try... Uh, hopefully Erin be home by then. If she not, we're going to try it together. The turtle nut and bun cake. This is how the sub look, y'all. It, it looks like very much so giving Jimmy John's. And I think it's $5.99. Is it the $5.99 or $6.99? But it's a nice size sub. And it looks like very much so giving Jimmy John's. And it's kind of like the Jimmy John's bread. But I'm about to eat this and then we're going to come back and we're going to try Okay. Let's see y'all. Let's see what it's giving. I got high hopes because I love turtle. Love turtles candy. And brownies. Oh, this warmed up with some ice cream. Hmm. Let's see. Did we get a pecan? I don't think so. That's good. We got a pecan in now. Oh, that's good. Mmm. Look at big piece. I see that. Uh, thought that was a piece of chocolate chunk. I think it's that. Chocolate chunks in here too. They do. I got a pecan in a. That sounds so fat. I got a pecan in a chocolate chunk in there. Oh! And I was thought about wearing an ear. And I'm probably gonna want it because it's chocolate. I don't know, I'm gonna save it some though. I'm gonna give it. That was another taco chunk. That's an, I was gonna say eight. That's a that's a nine out of ten. Heavy. This is good. It's so good. I don't know how late this, but y'all know I'm back on vlog, so it might be gone. Let me see the dates on here when it says it's leaving, cause I think today is the sixth. It came on the third. Let me see. Hold on. So it says. The 4th through the 17th. Or until it's gone. But I am going to post on Instagram for y'all. Just follow me. See, follow me on Instagram. Instagram always gets it first. So, yeah, y'all. The 4th through the 17th. Hopefully this vlog will be out before the 17th. Okay, I'm about to take me a nap. So, I, picked up, I might not pick the... I'm not, not likely going to pick up the camera again today. So, I will talk to you guys tomorrow. Hey, y'all. Happy Thursday. It's, um... 4.45, um, went to work today, then I picked up the camera this morning, I'm picking it up now, I still, <laughs> I still need to edit, and I, I put my hair, it looks like I'm bald in front, but that's like a reflection, but I put a little creamy crack on my hair, I got a uh, conditioner in it right now, but I don't even think the damn, y'all know I bought the perm from H-E-B, and against my better judgment, it was the last Regular one, because all they had was soup, and I'm not putting no damn soup on my hair. Y'all know I, my scab only allows me to put it on for a few minutes anyway. And the box was kind of open. I still bought it because I want it. I don't even... But none of the stuff was open, but I don't know if the perm even took. But we'll see, because I, I used a lot of grease. A lot of grease, because my scab was scabbing, so I used a lot of grease for the protectant. I don't know. 
whatever. We'll see once it, I wash this conditioner off, blow dry it, and whatever. Anyways, I'm about to make me a sausage sandwich. Yes, a sausage yeah. sandwich. Y'all know a sausage sandwich with a little strip of mustard on there, and I got that Hawaiian bread back there. And I'm about to eat these chips. Yeah, and that's about to be lunch. I'm probably not going to eat nothing for dinner. That's probably all I'm going to eat. It's 4 o'clock, so I might not be hungry again. But I'm about to eat these. You know, you know. Oh, and I, um, I wanted to eat the, uh, try the pickles with y'all because it's been since Sunday. Today is Thursday. They've been sitting, sitting. So I'll try the pickles with y'all. Let me get them out the refrigerator. This was the, I think the blueberry raspberry lemonade. The pineapple. I think Aaron already tried them. This was the, the strawberry pickleberry or something like that. And fruit punch. Found it. Where is the mailbox? I don't know where the mailbox. Aaron just went to the mailbox. Like on the opposite side of the pool, opposite side of the office. Pineapple. Pineapple ones. You want pickle? No, you don't want that. You like pineapple? That's good. I like pineapple. The blue raspberry fizz. No, the blue raspberry lemonade. What Jada and baby son say? Lemonade. Lemonade. It hit, hit you right here. A little sour, but it's good. Last but not least, this fruit punch is dark red. I think that fruit punch about to be good. and then a pineapple third. They good though. Y'all make some to y'all kids. Cause I know people be selling them and it's expensive. You just buy a jar of pickles, some Kool-Aid, some tangles and make them yourself. But, about to make my sausage sandwich. Um, chill, watch TV. What's today, Thursday? I think that, did y'all, y'all gonna watch this later so I'm not spoiling nothing cause this is gonna be, by the time this vlog come out, um, Love is Blind reunion probably didn't came out by the time this come out, so I can talk about it and not ruin nothing for y'all. But, um, that damn Clay. What did I tell y'all Clay was gonna do? 
What did I tell y'all Clay was gonna do? I knew Clay was gonna do exactly what Clay, I knew it. Bills are low, I'm scared. Bills. What is this? Oh. Anyways, uh Clay. I knew Clay was gonna get to the altar and do exactly. I said, I told my friend, I said, Clay, when she get to the altar, he gonna be like, I love you, I wanna be with you, I still wanna build with you. That's how he was that's how he was talking the whole season. Like, really trying like just a liar. He kept bringing up his daddy cheating every chance he got. I never been in a healthy, I never seen a healthy relationship. My parents together for a long time, but it wasn't a healthy marriage. My dad cheated most of the time. My dad cheated, my dad cheated. That's all he kept bringing up. Like, basically saying, I, I'm going to cheat too. That's all I saw. So, you know, I'm not really ready for it. But why did you go on the show? That's why I don't get with people going here. If I ever go on Love is Blind, I want to meet that person. I'm ready to get married. Because that's what the damn show is about. That's what it's for. I knew it. And then... Y'all, some people say they think he wasn't attracted to her. I think he was attracted to her body. Yeah. Her body was AD body. And I call AD ugly and that's, but I don't think he was, like, he never called her beautiful. He never said, like, hey, beautiful, you look beautiful. When she walked up in her dress, he was like, hey, body banging, like, ooh, you, your body. He never said, you look beautiful. You know how people are emotional on their wedding days. They cry. They, they be like... Like, just, like, look at you. Like, you look beautiful. You look stunning. He was like, hey, body. Like, all he said was he kept complimenting her body. He never told her she was beautiful. I never heard him. <clears throat> I could be wrong. I never heard him call her beautiful throughout the whole show. Like, you look beautiful. What's good morning, beautiful, gorgeous, nothing like that. He always talked about her body. That was it. And he said, he did exactly what I said he was going to do. I'm not ready for a relationship. Motherfucker, you should have been at a therapist's office instead of Love, and, Love is Blind line trying to audition and get in the show. Knowing you need to... Him and Chelsea. I already knew. Jimmy said, I-I. Jimmy said, I-I. Jimmy said her ass down. They didn't even... I knew they were going to make it to the altar. Jimmy said, uh-uh. I think she did that shit that last show about him going out with his friends and she was crying and she was uh, calling him a cheater. And she's like, I know you after I know you. Jimmy said... That day, right there, that's still the deal. He said, I can't go down, I can't walk down the altar. Oh, baby, she started crying. She started telling him he was having sex with his friends. Even though she told, he told her that he had sex with the girl. But now they, they're best friends. And she told him she's cool with her ex. They're friends. He's like, you was on FaceTime with the dude. I never tripped or nothing about it. Chelsea and Clay, they should have been in a therapist's office instead of Love is Blind. They had no business there. Clay just, I already knew. From the beginning, I knew. I knew. AD, the signs were there. But she was like, she can fix it. She called herself fix a hole or something like that. No, you can't. Not at that age. And then he started talking about her finances. He was like, because I think AD said she's a real estate agent, a fitness coach, and she did a lot of stuff. I think when they got back home, he was out of town. I think he does like RV, he, does, he rents like jet skis and stuff. He has like Airbnbs and stuff. So he was working. I don't think he saw her like move around and work or do nothing. So he was like, you supposed to do all this shit and you've been laying around. So he was saying something about her finances too. So I'm ready for the reunion. I think it come on next week. I'm ready for this. I'm ready to see, hear all this like, that damn Chelsea, but her, her and Clay should have been seeing a therapist. But yeah, I'm about to make my sandwich, sit down and chill. This might be the conclusion to this vlog. I don't know how long mommy. this vlog is. I ain't did shit this week. Hey, mommy. We'll work. And worked out eight. Taste these pickles for y'all. What? Like everything. What do you want? Like oh, it's in the room. Go get it from Turk. It's on Turk Charger. Go get it. You want his tablet? Um. So this might conclude this week's weekly vlog. Don't forget to comment, like, share, subscribe. I I'm about to edit this video tonight. And a vlog should come out Sunday. Bye, y'all. Friday, um, as y'all can see, before this, this morning I went to the gym, 
for home, took me a shower. It's just so convenient, y'all, having a gym in my apartment, apartments, not apartment, having a gym in my apartments and be able to walk there and walk back home, take a bath, still have time, and go to work. Like, I love that for me. I'm still going to do Fitness Connection and other stuff, but mainly y'all going to see me in there because it's just it's just too convenient. I did 30 minutes on the um, Stairmaster, and I did a few other things that I recorded in there I showed y'all, but I love that. Love. So, I'm on break. I think I'm about to go to um, Chipotle, give me some lunch. Or I might go to Los Tios and give me a little margarita and some lunch. I don't know. We'll see. And it's happy hour. Los Tios got $5 margaritas, and they be so good. Like, when I say good, you only really need one. So good. I don't know. Anyways, I have nothing planned today. Okay. Good jamming. I have nothing planned today when I get off. Kids leaving. It's their dad's weekend. I already watched Love is Blind. I think I, I watched... Uh, Marriage to Medicine reunion, but I missed like a couple shows for that. I might watch rewatch watch those shows, and I need to catch up on Potomac, so I might watch that tonight. Other than that, nothing else planned, so I might not pick up the camera no more tomorrow. I I go to work. I got a lash appointment. I got a wax appointment. Um, yeah, it's been a while. Got a wax appointment. Um. Nothing else planned. Like, I don't have nothing. Y'all know my kid-free weekends. I never have nothing planned. I don't got nothing planned. Sunday, we was supposed to do brunch at Joseph's house. He texted this morning and said that uh, he forgot he had plans with his family, So, which is fine. I might. I'm going to go to church. I haven't been to church, so I'm going to go to church and then whatever. Probably going to take myself to brunch. I really want to go back to the traveler's table. So... Yeah, I might go back to the travel table. I know last time, many, many vlogs ago, um, I went to the travel table. I had got that um, oxtail omelet. I went by myself, so I'll go again by myself. You got to make a reservation now because they food is so good, y'all. I had the oxtail omelet, and I had, like, the um, the sampler, the, a flight. I had a, a margarita flight. It was so good. They was good. They uh, that owner was so big. When I say they wasn't stingy with the oxtail, it was stuff. I think it was asparagus in there, too, and some kind of cheese. It was so good. So I might go back there Sunday. That's my plans. Chill. Pretty chill weekend. And a lot of editing. A lot of editing. If I can edit and schedule, like, two or three vlogs, I'll be caught up, y'all. I'm going to try to do that. Like, schedule them. Edit, edit and schedule them. Saturday when I get home. My last thing I have to do is my last appointment. I'm going to just start editing. Sunday, after brunch, I'm going to just edit. So, I'm going to have them out for y'all. Anyways, I'm about to go find me something to eat. Uh, I might pick y'all back up later. I might not. Happy Friday, y'all. Hey, y'all. I'm eating a pickle. Hey, y'all. Happy Saturday. I took y'all from work. Just got home. I'm about to take me a shower. Wash this condition out of my hair. Probably rolled out my hair. Because it's cold outside. Y'all, it's been hot all week. It's been hot all week. This lady messed up my brows. I just went and got my eyebrows done. My other lady haven't been there when I went. She wasn't there the last time and I let this lady do my brows. And she kind of made them thin. I let her ass do them again today and still thin. But... It's cold outside. I got up this morning, got dressed, no jacket or nothing, thinking it's going to be hot outside. Walked outside, turned right back around. It was like 50, 51 this morning. It's 61 now, but it's windy. It's it's cool. All week we've been in the 80s. It's been like 81, 77, Houston. But I'm about to take a shower, wash my hair, like I said, blow dry it. I'm going to get a wax at 4. Then I'm going to get my lashes done at 5. And I don't got nothing else planned today. I think I want to make this that I saw Tay, Eric and Tay on Instagram that does like all the it girls hair. He does, he does Nicki Minaj hair too. 
But he made this. Not with these frozen ass. Um, can y'all see it look like a whole gob of soda? That's salmon, asparagus, sausage, shrimp, and potatoes. And you just put it all in a pan and put it in the oven. But this, <laughs> you know, he can't. He used the frozen like cocktail shrimp. Them not even like raw. Sir, this like the cooked already. No, I'm not gonna use those type of shrimp. But I want to make this. So I, when I leave from getting my um lashes done, I'm gonna go to H E B get some salmon, asparagus, sausage, potatoes, and all that stuff, and just make me this tonight and watch some TV. Then plan. Meaning I ain't gotta spend no money. So it's whatever. Yesterday was a uh, national um. Women's Day. It was Women's Day. And I got some flowers, y'all. I got some flowers. Ain't they pretty? So pretty. I got a, some flowers and a card with some shmoneys. Yeah. I got that. That was so sweet. But yeah, y'all. I'm about to take me a shower. And I will pick you guys back up later. Yeah. After on this little dress, I got this from Forever 21. I think the year that I got my surgery it was like 2022 20, or 2021. A few years ago, I threw this on. Y'all got these. Y'all see? I got these blue ass Crocs on. I do not care. And I'm throwing on something over this because it's cold. But yeah, I'm about to head out, wash my hair. I don't know why my kitchen look like this. That's why I told you that friend probably kind of didn't take. It's a little nappy. Probably gonna flat out my hair when I get back. I just threw it up in this clip. But yeah, body is body in. Like, look. Oh, hey y'all. I am so full. I had tacos from Chipotle. I only ate two. I'm so, ooh, I need a nap. I can't wait to go get my lashes done. I'm definitely going to sleep. I'm saying, hey Mary, bye Mary. Going to sleep. No talking today, baby. <sighs> I am at European Wax. I'm in the car, but I'm right here. So scared. <laughs> oh, Lord. If you know, you know. Waxing is just not... I don't think it, it ever gets normal like you get used to it. It just hurts. It just hurts. Lord, that, that, that strip like across like that. Ooh, I can feel it now. <laughs> oh, Lord. Y'all know, ladies, that, 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 that one right there across that. Ooh. That's the worst. That's the worst. That's the worst one. Oh, uh, and I, my girl that normally does me, she didn't have any, um, uh, Thing late on Saturday. She ain't had no appointments on I don't think she had no appointments on Saturdays. She had some tomorrow, but so I'm going to somebody new. I hate going to new people, but I ain't trying to go out of town this weekend. I know I'm going to have to put a swimsuit on for uh, SeaWorld. I don't need... <laughs> I don't need that shit and them talking shit about me. Because, baby... Three fifty one. My appointment at four. I took those nails off. I'm gonna put some new ones on. I got these. They're like a little. You can't see them. A neon. A neon. Yeah, like a little lime neon. Y'all see? I'm gonna try these out. A little spring break nail. A little, you know, a little spring. Put them on when I get home. I'm so nervous, y'all. The fact that I gotta go to somebody new, and the fact that it's been a while, this about to hurt. <sighs> I wish I could just nair, but nairing it, it's just different. Like, I tried nairing one time, and that shit told me down. I don't see how, but I heard somebody say if you put cotton swabs, like, in but you know what, in between it, because when I used nair one time, When I say eight meat up, eight meat. Ooh. 
tone me down. But they said put Vaseline and then uh, cotton swabs right there so it doesn't get in. Uh-uh. I ain't got time. And then the whole growing back, it's going to grow back in a few days because you ain't doing nothing but nearing the hair off. Uh-uh. I need a few weeks. So wax it is. I'm back, y'all. <laughs> 409. It took her like five minutes. We were talking and stuff. Um, one through ten. Mm, about eight. <laughs> about a cool eight, eight and a half. Shoo. Lord, that's why I, I ain't waiting this long no more. Like, Lord Jesus. Like, I told y'all, it's that one across. That, ooh, that one at the. Uh, smell like us. I, I said smell. I feel like a newborn baby. But I'm about to head to my lash appointment. It's really not until five. So I'ma just be sitting there. She didn't have nothing but five o'clock. So I had to take that. Anyways, yeah. Talk to y'all later. Wax is all done. Hey y'all. I'm finally home. My lash is done. Stop by HEB. I got my goods. Got my shrimp. Lord, jumbo raw shrimp is on sale for five. Four ninety six. I got two pounds. I got shrimp. Got my asparagus, potatoes. Got my sausage just already cut up. I got another pack in the refrigerator, but it's just me. I'm not gonna cook that much. And I got some salmon. Probably only gonna put two of these and put the rest back in the freezer for something else. I got a little bitty pan, a little pan, cause he made a bigger pan, but it's just me here. Just me. And H-E-B finally has this. I don't know if the one by me has this garlic herb butter, but I went to the one by my last studio, a little farther down from me. And they had the um, garlic and herb butter. I normally find this at Walmart, but H-E-B, I never seen an H-E-B, and that H-E-B had it. And I got some Old Bay seasoning, lemon and herb. Got some butter. I'm also gonna use, um, of course I'm gonna use garlic. Who's that, uh, this um seafood seasoning with some garlic powder and all the other stuff yeah i'm about to cut up my um uh, cut up my potatoes and then yeah i'm gonna show y'all once i place everything season it put all the stuff in there make a little sauce put it over it so yeah brb okay y'all i got it all in a pan mm -hmm. sausage potatoes salmon asparagus Mm hmm shrimp. It's my little concoction, my little sauce. It looks spicy, but it's just seasoning and garlic. It's really red because I ordered, I, I said order. I added a uh, season. I think that's enough for them. It should be. I might add some more butter. I'm gonna add some more butter so it could be like drenched. Finished product, y'all. Little wham bam. Thank you, ma'am. I'm about to eat and I'm about to edit and I will talk to you guys tomorrow. Hey, y'all. Good afternoon. Happy Sunday. Um, I'm about to take a bath. Y'all, I went to the gym this morning on a good old Sunday. That's the benefits of having this gym right here, walking distance. I, I went over there. What time did I go to the gym? Like 10.30, 11 o'clock. Went and stayed for like an hour. Had a good little workout on this good old Sunday. Starting the week off right. Had a good workout. I had to go pick up Aaron from Moni's house. They went to the carnival. I went to the rodeo yesterday and I went to the carnival and stuff. So I picked her up this morning. 
then what else I did? I cleaned up a little bit. So I'm about to take a bath because I'm going to Uptown Hookah. Ashley Brothers 40th birthday is today. So we're just doing a little happy hour. Something light. Hopefully I'll be back home by 7.38 because I'm going at 4, 4.30. Be back home by 8 o'clock. My show's coming on tonight. I still need to finish editing. I know. It's just like when... When you get out the groove of it, like not having to edit, like I can pick this camera up. I got so much footage. I can record all day. It's the editing for me. Like once you get out of the groove, you got to get back in the groove. So I, I'm halfway done, y'all. I'm halfway done. Once I get back in the groove, I'm never going to stop. Like I, I have no excuse to stop. I have my own stuff. So I have no excuse. But anyways, um, I need to flat out my hair because it's a mess under this bonnet. Flat out my hair. Probably gonna throw on like some boy shorts, a t-shirt. It's Uptown Hookah. It's a little hookah lounge. Yeah, so I'll be back. Happy Sunday, y'all. Oh yeah, y'all. I put the nails on yesterday, last night too. 10 out of 10. It looked like I went to the nail shop. Got me a nice little shiny manicure. These are like the kiss. I even went, when I did pick up in, I stopped by H-E-B and I got some more. Because I love them. They, they look so good. You can't really tell if this lighting in here. I'll show y'all. I am out the tub, y'all. I'm about to flat iron this hair. Yeah. <laughs> what time is it? It's 1.54. I need to be leaving my house at least by 4 o'clock. It's not far at all. It's uptown. It's on Richmond. It's had to take me like 15 minutes to get there. So I'm about to flat iron this hair. See if I can do it in an hour. Easy doing my hair by 3. Let's see. Let's see if y'all can hear these people upstairs. I ain't the fall and see if I can hear these people upstairs. I ain't the fall and sleep on. I hope y'all can hear that. I ain't the fall and sleep on the couch this, uh, last night. So, about 6 30, 7 o'clock in the morning. Stumping like they got fucking comeback boots on. Like they then put on some construction boots and started stumping with the big dogs. And it lasted for like an hour and a half. They're going to see me real soon. Before I go snitch. <laughs> before I go be a little snitch in the office. Because I know I have a toddler. Like, I have kids. If it lasts for a little while, okay. Kids going to, you know. But for like an hour and a half, early in the morning, and they doing it right now? Oh, no. Nah. Because I be having to tell Eli. He, Eli, since Eli's able to walk, we've been living in that house. He don't know about you can't be stumping and all that in apartments. Like, he don't know that. So, I have to tell him, like, hey, you lot of people live downstairs. Stop. You know, walk quiet. Like, can't be running through here. Yeah. I'm going to have to go knock. Hi. It's very loud. I'm going to say really nice the first time. Then I'm, I'm turning to Karen. I'm going to tell the office. Hey, y'all. All done. It's 4 o'clock. I said an hour. It's 4 o'clock. I was BSing on Instagram, stopping. So, I finally finished. It's 4. I'm about to head there. Let me see what I'm going to put on. Probably this. That product intense. I want to mix it with this product candy that I never wear. I would only wear this mixed. I don't know why. I've kept it for years. But I never wear it, but it smells really good mixed with this other product. And it stays for a long ass time. Yeah, I'm about to head out. My hair came out pretty good. Y'all, when I took that braid down, this last time I had that, uh, my wig, I don't know what she sprayed to go to braid my hair down. What she sprayed on my hair, because my scalp was really dry. She sprayed something on my hair that my scalp did not like. And I got psoriasis. That was the worst, like, flake up, flare up I've ever had. Like, I lost, if I didn't have thick hair, like, my hair was way thicker than this. If I didn't have thick hair, I would be so bald because so much of my hair came out. Like, with the flakes, like, I had, like, a, a little trans, transparent moment. I got, like, a bald spot somewhere. Where is it? There you go, right here. Y'all see it? Yeah. It was like a 
big cake up right there that I combed out. I couldn't avoid it. My hair was going to go with it. Rather, I tried to take my time. So I just combed it out. Whole glob of hair came with it. I got another one over here. And next month, I'm supposed to try bo boho braids. Because I want to try them. I want some fucking braids. This psoriasis is just like, ugh. And it gets worse as I get older. It's getting worse. So I probably need to go see a dermatologist again. I've seen dermatologists twice. They give me this shampoo. Nothing works. So I'm probably going to need to go see another one. I don't know. But I'm going to try boho braids. And you think like, oh, I'm doing protective style. I'm not messing with it. And I don't know what she sprayed. <sighs> Anyways, I'm dressed. Let me show y'all the fit. It's really simple. I told y'all some biker shorts, this little kid's shirt, and my panda dunks. And I'm still rocking this damn <laughs> fanny pack. Since the rodeo, y'all, I'm still wearing this damn fanny pack. Is my camera blurring? Yeah, I'm still, my hair, like, it ain't just, you know, we still got some length, we still, but my hair, if you know, you know, my hair was way longer than this, and it was fuller, but anyways, I'm gonna cry about it, I'm dressed. Of course I'm here. Anybody here? No. And they said they want to be gone by 8.30, it's 5 o'clock. I at least tried to, you know, wait because I already know people be on CP time. Came later and they're still not here. How y'all want to be going by 8.30 and it's 5 o'clock and nobody's here? Black people, y'all got to do better with timing. Like, it's upsetting me and my homegirls. Not even my homegirls because my homegirls is late. Shit. So, here we go.